All right, Modesto Nesta returning yep. for another season of championship baseball. Yeah, Big Al is live in Modesto at John Thurman Field for a preview of the 2024 season. Why aren't they going to let you on the field? I need to see you bat. I, I, I want to I wanna see myself bat, too. I'd be kinda, I could probably hit a couple of balls, uh, at least to the pitcher's mound. That's about as good as I can get, but leave it to the professionals to do their thing because the professionals won the championship. The Modesto Nuts won it. The field is beautiful, by the way. I have to say that. And, Veronica, let me tell you, you've been kind of schooling me on all things Modesto Nuts here. So this is a single A, uh, single a baseball affiliate of the Seattle Mariners, correct? Correct, yeah. So we have been affiliated with the Mariners since October of 2016, uh, and we're just loving it. They have a great crew, uh, two championships already with the Mariners. So. Man, that's crazy. I mean, that, uh, you got a great, that means the great, the farm system is for real, for real, is very, very good. And I, I, I'm, I'm digging the jerseys because I have family that lives in Seattle. Mm -hmm. so. I get Ken Griffey vibes right there. That's yeah. really, really, really good right there. Definitely. Uh, so this uh, baby blue jersey over here is uh, representing the 1980s uh, jersey that the Mariners had way mm -hmm. back when. So that's going to be our Sunday fit. So Modesto Mariners on Sundays. Okay. Uh, but then the last game of the season, September 8th, uh, that Sunday we're going to be doing a silent auction and proceeds are going to the Boys and Girls Club. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean say that everybody's really good on the squad. They had to win like... 16 out of 17 games or 18 games just to make the playoffs and then after that it was smooth sailing oh <laughs> uh yeah i guess the the outside perspective was smooth sailing but the guys <laughs> definitely put in their heart and soul and i'll be honest the fans came in hard and gave them that support and gave them that extra push through the door so yeah. champions here we go oh so, so i think to celebrate as well as with the modesto mariners but you guys are also doing some things with the doggies here <laughs> i know they're just hanging out hey what's up what's up how you guys doing? <laughs> so we got Sunny and Shadow here hanging out. But yes, we do have Pups and Pints every Thursday home game. So every Thursday home game, dogs are welcome. You just have to come through the first base gate, uh, sign a waiver, and then they're able to come in for free. So come hang out in your seat. For those that aren't a fan of dogs or allergic, we do have a human section. Okay. So okay. let us know and we can help you out on that end too. But the best part about our Pups and Pints night, I would say, is probably the dog park post game. Nice. So the dogs get to run around post game and enjoy a very, very large uh, piece of grass for sure. <laughs> they'll be, they'll be having if I can see them right there in left center field, just running around, <laughs> and just acting the fool. It'd be beautiful, It'd be a beautiful sight. So, so many great things happening here at the ballpark. But you know what? There'll be next hour. We're going to talk about all the great things and oh. The championship yep. ring. Yep. Guys, showcase the championship Definitely. ring. Definitely. Let's show it off. Yes, yes. And so pretty here, top of the hour, uh, and also a little bit later on the 9 o'clock hour, we will show off the ring, how you can get the ring. They won the championship. You get the ring. <laughs> we'll deal with that next hour. Back over to you guys. Right. Hey. Right. hey poo -poo. Play ball. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Al. Yes. Thank you, Al. It's National Coffee Cake Day. I do like